This is a, an example of how you can transfer files in IPFS. I've basically done a, a bit of a revamp to the UI and uh, I've supercharged it with PubSub. This is an open pull request, it's still a work in progress, but you can see that the readme is already, uh, is already updated. And if you want, you can come in JS IPFS to the, this branch, docs revamp exchange files, and you can see the readme. So uh, what this does is you can come, you have to start the app, of course, the example. Uh, you basically can come to a workspace, for example, uh, Lisbon Hack Week, and you have here the interface. You can see it's initializing a node. The node is now ready. You have our node ID and our address. This is the list of the connected peers. There's a lot. If you want to connect to a specific peer, you just put his multi-address here and connect. And here you have the, our files. This is interchangeably with the Go IPFS node, so you can spawn a Go daemon, add a file there, just uh, copy paste the hash here, fetch, and it will, be, it will be headed to here. So, but the cool thing is, uh, we can just, uh, sorry, first we'll, we'll open a new tab. We'll come to this workspace too, initializing the node, node is ready. We can just drag and drop a file here. You can see it's been added to our list. And with PubSub, it's been uh, downloaded and synchronized here too. So you can just download here the file or here, whatever. Basically, we, we can transfer files between uh, two completely separate. Uh, for this, I'm using the same port and the same browser, but you can switch between ports and stuff and PubSub will automatically sync the files. Uh, just one thing missing that is not implemented yet. I've been working on that, but I've been struggling a bit. You, you should be able to just open a new tab now. These two are synchronized. You should be able to open a new tab and get the files that are already in this workspace. I'm struggling a bit with that, but <laughs> that's that, yeah. It's basically it. Uh, yeah.